If you ever wanted to become an artist or learn more about painting, clear your calendar this sir, this Saturday. Yeah, and this morning, Zevely Zone, Jeff previews the second annual San Diego Coastal Art Studios Tour. This home in Pacific Beach is just one of five stops on the art tour, and it was once owned by a famous San Diegan. This is what gives us joy. No matter the beauty, to Dot Rinshaw, the most important part of a painting is for art to be seen. No one's going to knock on your door, walk to your bedroom, and look under your bed at your artwork, okay? That's why Dot and fellow artist Leah Higgins started the San Diego Coastal Art Studios Tour. People can just walk up to an artist, meet an artist, ask them about their work. Everything. Last year, they hosted their first art tour and hoped a few people would show up. We got 1,600, <laughs> and people go, you've got to do it next year. They are, and in 2022, sparks will fly with 13 different types of art. The art tour takes place this Saturday from 10 to 5. You can visit five home studios like this one, meet 29 artists in Pacific Beach and La Jolla within a three-mile radius. Kate Sessions may be just a name on a park or a school to you, but did you know the famous horticulturalist was also known as the mother of Balboa Park? She built this house? She built the house. This is her custom home. Leah's parents bought this property in 1947. This is definitely one of hers. This is a Chinese cherry. And what better garden to host an art tour? I would think for a San Diegan, just showing up to look at a tree, Kate Sessions planted. She planted. From Africa. Yeah. Would be very exciting. From beginners to experts. I want them to see the world through the eyes of an artist. The color of a community will be on display. Everybody's an artist. Everybody's an artist. It's deep inside you, and we want to bring it out. In the Zevely Zone. Get into your art, and the world opens up to you. Jeff Zevely, CBS 6.